Hello, and welcome to Journey Through Jersey, the organization dedicated to heritage tourism in New Jersey and the preservation of historic sites. For the next few months on this channel, we will put a spotlight on 48 different historic sites throughout the state. Typically every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, check back for a new video about the history of each site, what there is to see, and what are the local attractions. Today, we will start by putting a spotlight on the Botto House, which is located in Howden, New Jersey. The Botto House is the former home of Pietro Botto and his family. It is the first Italian-American site to be designated as a National Historic Landmark. Maria and Pietro Botto immigrated to this country from Italy. They found work in the silk industry in Patterson and purchased a home in nearby Howden, where they rented the second floor to other immigrants. The Botto House became a landmark because of major events in the labor industry that took place on the grounds. During the 1913 Patterson Silk Strike, the Bottos offered their home as a gathering place for the 15,000 strikers to hear rousing speeches by leaders of the Industrial Workers of the World, or the IWW. The strike was a turning point in U.S. labor history. However, the house is not just a restored relic of the Bottos' 1908 home. Instead, it is also home to the American Labor Museum, which showcases the history of work, workers, and the labor movement throughout the world with special attention to the ethnicity and immigrant experience of American workers. Today, the museum features historic photographs of workplace conditions, wage scales, picket lines, strikers' meetings at the Bottos' home, and the organizers of the IWW. When visiting, check out the historic balcony from which union organizers and supporters, such as Upton St. Clair, addressed 20,000 striking men, women, and children during the silk strike. The museum also hosts a library that is open to the general public and a gift shop that sells a wide variety of items such as t-shirts, books, and posters. If the furnished period rooms and the museum are not your thing, you can also check out the Botto family's Old World Gardens, which features a grape arbor, root cellar, and a bocce court. The Botto House also offers special programs throughout the year. Just this month, the museum hosted the May Day Festival, which featured live vocal and musical performances. Educational classes such as labor art classes on Saturdays are offered for students in grades 3 through 5. The museum even offers opportunities for the completion of Eagle Scout projects. Tours are available for the house and the museum for $5 per person. The Botto House is open Wednesday through Saturday from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. or by appointment. Well, that's our spotlight on the Botto House located in Howden, New Jersey. For more information on the Botto House and the American Labor Museum, check the links in the description below. Also check out the Facebook link in the description below that lists other popular attractions and restaurants in the area. Come back on Wednesday for another video that will spotlight a different historic site in New Jersey. Feel free to comment below any of your thoughts, feedback, or questions you may have. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and share this with your friends if you would be so kind, as it really helps us out. And until next time, thanks for watching.